Hi guys, this is Method School and in today's video, I'm going to show you how you do multiplication of two fractions with negative signs like these and exponents like these. Now, put your calculator away and go ahead and try solving this problem yourself. Pause the video if necessary and when you're done, put your answer into the comment section to test yourself. I'm going to show you the correct answer in just a second, so you can check whether you got it right or not. Then I'll highlight this very common error or very common errors that a lot of people make when doing basic problems like this. So if you got this wrong, review what you've, what you've done wrong with me and never make the same mistake again. And that's the point of all of my math lessons I post here. So without further ado, let's go ahead and solve this problem. So, here I have negative parenthesis 4 over 5 parenthesis squared multiplied by parenthesis, and this time the negative sign is within the parenthesis, 2 and 1 half, and then parenthesis is closed and it's squared. So let's go ahead and solve this. So what I would do first is to just write down what I have and this time when writing down I am going to change mixed fraction into improper fraction for the ease of multiplication that is so what do I do 2 times 2 plus 1 should go into the numerator because there is a number 2 and I multiply with numerator and I add the denominator. That you should already know. If you do not know, please review the section uh, about mixed and improper fractions. And then I close the parenthesis and square it. So, what I end up with is parenthesis negative 5 over 2 squared. Now, if you take a look at this expression right here, we have negative sign, we have parenthesis, and we have exponent. Because we have more than two operations here, we need to think of order of operation or the rule of PAMDAS. And according to the rule of PAMDAS, I need to take care of parenthesis first, but there's nothing, no operation within the parenthesis, so let's skip that. And the second thing that I need to deal with is exponent, which is this one. So before I deal with this negative sign here, I am going to square this uh, fraction first, and then add the negative sign. So if I do that, what do I get? Uh, 4 over 5 times 4 over times, uh, 4 over 5, and then add negative sign. That's the first fraction done. And then the second fraction, this time I am squaring this whole fraction with negative sign. So what I do, what I have, what I end up with is negative 5 over 2 times negative 5 over 2. Okay, so I have negative 16 over 25 multiplied by negative negative gets cancelled down and I get 25 over 4. Now if I multiply these two fractions, I can cross cancel these numbers and also these numbers and end up with 1, 1, 4, 1. So what I do get is negative 4 over 1 times 1 over 1 or negative 4. And that's going to be our final answer. Now notice that I put the... Um, uh, parenthesis here to make sure that I am dealing with exponent first before I ever deal with this uh, multiplication. So, um, so you might have 
uh, felt confused, but that's why I added the uh, set of parentheses there. But except that, I hope this made sense to all of you. And if you feel like you need more practice with me, I have posted lots of worksheets on my method school on method.school and I have worksheets in subject areas like these and you can access them by clicking this button right here. So thanks for listening and please like my video and please please consider subscribing to my channel because it really really motivates me and helps me greatly mostly psychologically. So thank you for listening. I'll see you guys in another video. Bye!